All right. So we have defeated Grima once, sealing him away. Now it is time for us to make our way through these extra paralogs. Um, of course, we'll also see the other ending to the game. I think I'll probably actually, I still have, I think just before we defeated him, saved. So we can actually check that out. Maybe right now, actually. All right. Here we are. And once again. But this time with Grima falling by Norman's hand. Right. Now, Norman, this is our chance. I'm going to finish it. No. No, you are not. Sorry, Krom. Sorry, Morgan. <laughs> Norman? Wait, what? <clears throat> what? What are you doing? <sighs> For once, I'm glad you and I are the same. Now I can give my life to protect those I care for. You would what? not dare. Making the ultimate sacrifice to protect all future generations. Hmm. All right. I would and I will. The evils you would visit on this world are unthinkable. In some way, I, we share the blame. No. You, you absolutely do not, Norman. That is all on Grima. You might share his blood, but you chose a different path, and you're making the ultimate sacrifice to put him down for good. You bear no blame. It's only right we meet our end together. <laughs> no! Hmm. Creepy face. Hmm. I'm not sure if that was the same animation as the uh, ceiling version or not. Norman? Oh no. There it goes. Norman! No! <laughs> Thank you, Krom, for everything. Tell the others my last thoughts were of them. Aw, Norman. May we meet again in a better life. May we meet again, yep. I'm not sure what exactly is happening. Uh, we're, if I'm not mistaken, destroying Grimace's soul, though, so... I'm not sure if that'll be possible, Norman. Wait! Norman! No! Oh, gods, no! Choosing not to let the suffering be revisited upon future generations. <sighs> the war is ended, my friends. Never again will the fell dragon trouble our world. Oh, you all far more than words can ever repay. Especially Norman, who gave himself to save us all. To save all the worlds to come. <laughs> Poor Norman. <laughs> After everything he did for us. No. Don't cry, Lyssa. We'll see him again. I'm sure of it. I'm less sure, Krom. Remember what Naga said? No? Norman would survive if our ties were strong enough. Ah, right. This isn't over. I believe Norman is out there. Somewhere. And if there was more to him than just the fell dragon, which I believe there is. Yeah. 
I'll choose to put I'll choose to believe. And I'll find him. If it takes me the rest of my days, I'll find him. Mm-hmm. You're right. He has to be out there somewhere. And we'll find a way to bring him home. Even if we have to search every open field in this whole stupid world. <laughs> yes. Find where he's taking a nap. Perhaps for having forgotten everything again. Ah. I believe the same, my prince. Norman is too strong to simply disappear. It falls to us to look after the realm until he returns. Yeah. Norman had damn well better come back. If that blasted dragon truly got him, I'll be the one breathing fire. <laughs> Thanks, Sully. <sighs> he made a noble sacrifice, and I know my nobility. <laughs> Thanks, Varian. You would get along very well with two certain nobles we know. And I know Norman shall someday return. Yeah. Norman has got to be out there somewhere. How do I know? Hey, you don't question the vake. Damn straight. No one questions the vake. The vake hmm. says it, it's true. I can feel it too. Norman is out there waiting for us. Though I surely will miss him in the meantime. Hmm. Uh. Well, statistically unsubstantiated, I have the, what the layman might call a hunch. <laughs> hey. Hey. Better than nothing. This hunch corroborates most of the statements made thus far. Excellent. <sighs> Norman, I know you're out there. I know you're not gone. And no one knows more about me being lost and found than me. <laughs> well, mostly lost and not found, but yeah. <sighs> I wish he could have stayed with us long enough to see me grow stronger. You are already plenty strong, Sumia. You made sure your daughter surpassed you, but... There's no shame in having your children surpass you. But all the more reason to work hard between now and his return. <laughs> he lives. I know it. Some people just aren't the dying sort. <laughs> yeah, but even those sorts can die. Right. And death comes for everyone eventually. Crom believes that he's all right, and so do I. Maybe I can work out some new magic to bring him home. <laughs> hey, go for it, Rickon. <sighs> if he returns to us now, I might even consider making him tea. Myself. Ooh, wow. Not even having one of your servants do it. That is. A very kind gesture, Mary Bell. Do you hear that, Norman? Me! Making tea! You should be honored! <laughs> Thanks. I do kind of like her. Her, uh, noble snootiness. <laughs> Let us honor Norman's regard for his warren. He was a true Tagoel. Hmm. <laughs> spirit of a Tagoel. And a true Tagoel would not leave family behind. I feel he's out there. Huh. If Norman's anything like me, he won't be he won't check out just cause a job is done. Gotta collect on all the sweet rewards, right? Hm. If only it were that simple. It were just a choice. <sighs> Too many times now have I watched loved ones give their lives for me. Aw, Cordelia. I must hold on to faith that this time will be different. Hmm. Oi, Norman, you daring to make Gregor celebrate alone? <laughs> no, no, you have no E in the rest. Gregor will, Gregor not rest until he drink you under table. Ah ha! Now try not to kill him. <laughs> you know, by drinking him under the table. <laughs> Norman's not gone. He's just misplaced. <laughs> well, now we gotta find him. I'll wait, I'll wait a thousand years for him if I have to. Well, you'll, uh, 
probably live long enough, so... If he shows up randomly in the future, we'll be in a prime position to find him, Noe. You and Na. In Naga's name. Naga has a way of spending a ray of sending a ray of light into even the deepest darkness. May Norman find that light, just as he became the light for us. <sighs> You'd better march back here and try again. <laughs> oh no. Darja will kill him if he dies. I only s I only send people off on my terms, or in a casket. <laughs> well, you can set off the casket, just won't have a body. Oh, there will be one less sweet set of eyes on me as I dance. Feels wrong. And normally, you'd be happy for that, but not anymore. And that's touching. Please come back, Norman. Please be out there somewhere. Oh. Minerva says she still feels Norman of, is of this world. Excellent, Minerva. Your nose can't track him, can it? Also, that he smells delicious. <laughs> but that's neither here nor there. <laughs> Please don't eat Norman if you find him, Minerva. <sighs> hey, Norman. Everyone's dying to see you alive. We're sick to death of death. Thanks, <laughs> Henry. That reminds me of a good one. Two risen, a wyvern, and a priest walk into a bar. Hey, <laughs> give me the punchline. You bastard, Henry. Don't leave me hanging. We have won our future, but we are in debt to so many sad memories. I pray at least one of those sadnesses will yet be undone. Hmm. Right. I swear my life and blade to defend this future you have won, Norman. If you can hear me, swear that you will help me to do so. Right. He did what he had to do. That's the mark of a true warrior. Damn straight, Basilio. He'll be back. I'd bet my sweet brown arse on it. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> bah! Leave it to Norman to take responsibility for all of us. And he was the only one who could. If he cared for us that much, I hope he knows how we still need him. Uh, thanks to you and the others, I was able to change. And I've got more changing to do. I want you to see it. You will. <laughs> Maybe. You've done so much for me and all my many, many sisters. Brought you much good business. You're an extra special uh, customer. I hope we meet again. Hmm. Hmm. I feel a soul straight and true pulsing in the darkness. The hero will return. <laughs> <sighs> no tears today. I know he'll be back. I'll just have to wait and try to smile. <laughs> Won't cry. He'll be back. I know it. <laughs> oh, Brady. I always will love the, uh, the, uh, dichotomy of, or the confliction of how you look with how you are. And in the meantime, I'll write the finest song that ever about him that ever was. I am glad for our victory, but I wish it did not mean so sad a farewell. I still have so much to learn. Come back and teach me. <sighs> now I know what it really means to be a hero. Yeah, that's actually very true, Cynthia. That was a truly heroic thing to do. But heroes always come back to fight again. No, not always. But they make that sacrifice anyways. <laughs> cool. Why did you sacrifice yourself? I refuse to accept it. Turn, Norman. Face my wrath. <laughs> of course, Severa. You wouldn't dare face your wrath. <sighs> he showed me that I had. He showed me that I have a future. That destiny can be defeated. 
We have to believe we can alter destiny once more and bring him back. Hmm. Just don't go back in time to do it. Don't undo a sacrifice. No. Father, you can't leave me now. Not like this. Oof, the one that hits the hardest. Mm. I believe in you. Come back. The only person she really had memory of. Oh, this death. No more. Please, you've you've got to come back. <sighs> the world is vast and full of potential unexplored. I shall devote myself to discovering that art which might reunite us. Hmm. You and your mother <laughs> might be able to do it. And Rick and why not? No, this is all wrong. He can't be dead. He's out there. We have to be patient and believe. Yeah. Especially since uh, I would hate to see what would happen to you in just your mother's care without Norman there to help protect you. <laughs> this is all wrong. We can't just leave Norman for dead. I'll wait until the end of time for his return. <laughs> you and your mother, and maybe Tiki, maybe Tiki too. <sighs> Norman put others before himself. No one can question his character. But his work is not done. He is still needed here. Hmm. Norman has secured for us all the most precious... Uh, Norman has secured for us all the most precious gift. A future. Now it falls upon our shoulders to protect what was given. I vow to give my all to healing the damage this war has wrought upon the realm. When Norman returns, I want him to see what his sacrifice bought. Norman, if you can hear me, you will always have a place here with us. Remember that. Hmm. Always. Always and forever. Now, I don't imagine most of these have changed. The only ones that might have are Tharja's and Norman's. So we'll, we'll go ahead and see those. I kind of like the bittersweet one, the nature of this one, that they didn't confirm whether he came back. Though maybe it's that's maybe that's premature. For all I know, they confirm it in his, uh, his, his epilogue. I'm worried about trying to skip ahead. Um, that might skip to the very, very end of the credits. I'll just sit through it. Well, at least Morgan still has a happy life with Jerome. What about no uh, Norman? Nothing for Norman. So they are going to leave it vague then. I don't think I saw anything for Tharja either. So I missed it. But okay. I like that ending too. So uh, I like the bittersweet nature of it. Slightly hopeful, but also the sense of loss. Well, next time we'll we'll we'll, we'll let this be standalone. Next time we'll get into the first of the uh, additional paralogs. Uh, probably do them in number order. do something oh what do you propose we do oh shit i don't know <sighs> huh i see you're awake now hey there <laughs> there are better places to take a nap than on the ground you know <laughs> yeah give me your hand oh my god Well, 
Welcome back. It's over now. <laughs> oh my god. That's cool. There it is. How many wrote of Norman's legendary exploits, but accounts of his origins and character varied? Scholars, poets, and bards agreed on one thing alone. He loved his wife, Sarja, above all else. Or else. Hmm. Excellent. 